that that gets you that gets you well, and that's what we got to keep. We got to keep the energy right there, and and then as we go on, we'll hopefully just get a little bit better. Coach, speaking of urgency, did you see a tangible sense of urgency tonight that's been missing, and particularly from Carmelo <coughs> on both ends of the floor? Yeah, well, I don't know if it's been missing. I don't want to get into that, but uh, yeah, he 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 played. Now, you know, he had 38 the other night, and. Uh, He's picking it up, there's no doubt about it. But I thought the whole team defensively got into people a lot more, especially in the first half. Um, guys from the bench, Sheldon Williams, Anthony Carter, they came in and gave us good muscle or energy, whatever you want to call it. And, uh, you know, good wins, just, well, one's one of those rare ones. Um, but it's just everybody contributed something, which is good. Do you like that when a guy says, this is almost a must win? I mean, is that, and then backs it up? I mean, obviously, yeah. is a good yeah. thing, but do you yeah. like it when he says that? No doubt about it. I hope he says it more often. It'd be nice. <laughs> but, yeah, no, it's, you know, and, and the, both those guys will have big games and big moments. That's what they do. And uh, if we can, again, I'll just keep going back. If we can keep the intensity and the urgency right there, and then, uh, <coughs> then we can get out of this slump for sure. What was that uh, defensive intensity a product of? Was it a product of shame? No, I, I, boy, that's, that's hard. Yeah, that's, that's tough. Uh, no, it's a product of whoa, we're, we're in trouble. <laughs> you know, and it's just they kept ratcheting it up, and uh, you just got to get to the point where it is. And um, again, a lot of games, a lot of nights, a lot of things, and uh, and who knows what causes it? Sometimes things sap your energy, and you might not even be aware of it. But uh, um, with efforts like this, the team will come together, and, and we'll be better for it. Coach, you talked about Sheldon coming off the bench, giving you some, some good minutes out there. What did he do? What did you see from him tonight, the way he was defending uh, Dwight? Well, he's bigger. You know, he has some strength to back up what he does. He's a very smart post player, and uh, he was just, you know, banging him and pounding him. Did as well as you could do against Dwight. I mean, Dwight first half didn't have any field goals, obviously, and well, he ended up with nine. He's a handful. But uh, Sheldon let us fake at him and kind of stay with the perimeter guys a lot more than what we normally could do. And uh, he gave us that effort and he just played well, he just played smart. And basketball is not a, you gotta play smart to win. And I thought he did it. Coach, it seemed there was a conscious effort from your team to be the aggressor. Was that just the way the game evolved? Is that something you talked about prior to the game? Well, we, we talk about that and we want Amari to be aggressive. We, Tony has to be aggressive. We, you know, we need his speed, his ability to make shots and things of that sort. Uh, even, even though he missed a couple down the stretch, he's got to keep shooting and keep playing and play his game. Um, I thought all of them, and especially Carmelo, was, was after it. And when they do that it, and back it up with good defense, you know, we, we can get better defensively, but it's pretty good effort. Any part of you wonder where the hell has this been for 48 or 53 minutes in this case, the last 10 games? Well, I mean, you've had your ups and downs. Yeah, mostly downs. Um, Everyone. You know, it's, it's, it's trying to figure out why, because they're, they, they want to do it. So there's other reasons. It's not, you know, I think people have a misconception. It's just, you know, oh, just go out and make that shot, or just go play easy, or just play smart, or just play. It's a little bit more complicated, and uh, sometimes things sap your energies. and. And you're not feeling good, and you don't feel right about it, and uh, and that's where the chemistry has to come in. And uh, again, you just draw a line in the sand. And you're gonna kick somebody's ass tonight, and you got to do it. And if you do it, then you got n another chance on Wednesday to do it. So I don't really dwell on what happened before. We got to take this and go forward. And and again, we've been here before. We were like this against Miami, and then it slipped away. We just can't let it slip away. Coach, as far as the uh, lineup issues that we were talking about before the game, I mean. You got the win. Do you stick with Sean, or do you go back to Sheldon because he played so well? Well, yeah, I like Sean because he can give us, he can spread the floor. And uh, a couple of fouls won't hurt us. A couple of fouls on Sheldon would hurt us real quick, and he kind of limits your uh, possibilities. I need Sheldon on the floor when Amari goes out with a four-minute mark. So if Sheldon gets two quick fouls, then Amari has to go out and rest. kind of depletes what we have. So I do like this, and uh, hopefully we can stick with this a little bit.